What's up guys? Welcome, welcome back to another Drag Tune video. This is your boy Mars. Today, as you guys see, we're going to continue with the Fast and the Furious cars. And uh, as you guys see in the background, got for you guys the Datsun. Really nice looking vehicle here that they gave us in the car pack. So I'm going to show you guys a full build on it, full tune on it. So like always, everybody new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and let's get right to it. So as you guys see... We got the 73 Fast and Furious Datsun 240Z from the Fast X movie. Let's go right to the upgrades. Right in here, all you can do is either make the vehicle all-wheel drive or leave it rear-wheel drive. So we're going to leave it rear-wheel drive. And let's go right to the build. All we're going to do is just put all the parts on their race. Really easy. Just put all the parts here, race. There we go. So we get a real nice 1,142 horsepower with A59 on the torque. Uh, weighs 200 or two, actually 2,200 pounds. So it's the lightest weight car, but also has the less amount of least amount of horsepower compared to the other cars. Um, so it is what it is. It still moves really good, though. Love the fact how like the turbo sticks out of the uh, hood there. And then you got the, uh, you know, the exhaust on coming out from the side and everything like that. Looks really, really cool on the car. Like the stickers, like how they put the stickers on the banner on the top. I uh, can't wait for them to add something like that to like maybe the newer Horizons or something like that. That would be awesome. So that's it with the build on the parts. Let's go outside, go to the um, suspension here. Let's make sure to put everything raised besides this here. We've got to do rally on the suspension. Soft suspension is actually really good for it. Uh, besides that, you're going to put the rest of the parts here race, just like so we can reduce all that weight and let this thing do some real nice numbers. Now go to the drivetrain, make sure to do the same. Put all the parts on here race. Very easy and simple. There you go. And then let's go right to the tires. Make sure to put the correct drag tires, which is all the way in the bottom. Put these. Do not put the semi-slicks. Do not put semi-slicks. Make sure to put the correct drag tires so you can get that nice grip. No need to go wider in the front since the vehicle is rear-wheel drive, uh, So, but we are going to go as wide as we can in the rear. We got two 95s in the rear. Rear nice stickies with the, uh, you see that wide fenders on there looking really, really cool on the vehicle. Uh, besides that, any wheels you guys want that are super light, make sure to drop those on the vehicle. That would be pretty good. And uh, that is it. Leave the size alone at 17 and also 17 in the front and rear. If you guys want to put some spacers to make it look a little bit more aggressive, you know, you can see it looks way better with the body. Uh, you guys can. So you can put that on the vehicle. And that is it. There's just like Forza stuff that we're not going to not gonna do at all. And let's go right to the tune, guys. You got 40 on the tire pressure in the front. Really nice inflated on the front. But then all the way lowered at 15 so we can get maximum grip. Then we got 220 final drive. First gear is 415. Second gear is 260, 190, 145, 120 on fifth gear. So really nice gears come back to back to back. Then we got everything zeroed out in seven. We got 65, 65. Then we got soft in the front, stiff in the rear at 300. Remember, the numbers don't have to be exactly the same as long as it's around 300. You're good. And the vehicle rates all the way up to the sky, front and rear. Then we got one, nine, nine, and one. So you can just make this nine or 8.9. Because I guess it doesn't let you do nine. Nothing with this, nothing with this, and 100 and 100. So really, really nice, easy, easy of a build here. Let's go outside real quick for a nice little spin with this car and uh, take it out to the track. See what it does on the track. Weather's looking good. We're over here in this uh, Buena Esperanza house. Kind of sounds like a two uh, JZ engine. Take it out for a spin. Let's have you guys hear it.
together really nice. Let's see. So we're here in the tunnel. Let's do a pass here in the tunnel. Uh, see what it does here in the tunnel. This thing sound crazy. I think it's about like two of these poles or something like that. I forgot how I measured it. That's a quarter mile. Um, let's do pretty much it really easy. Just e-brake and gas. Press down on the telemetry here. We got 31 pounds, 32 pounds of boost at 366 on that torque. 2,000 RPMs. Very, very, very nice. Let's do one more pass here and then we can bring it out to the uh, half a mile. This one's about three poles, if I'm not mistaken. Nice, I mean, 180s, 180s on a quarter mile, that's, that's really nice. Let's go here to the half a mile real quick, and then do some passes here in the half a mile. That, that'll sum up the video, a really nice vehicle. We are in winter now, so it's going to be dry season from what I heard. That's what winter is over here in Mexico, it's dry season. I had the vehicle wheelie for you guys, but the vehicle was wheeling so much. Um, I'd rather just have you guys have more of a consistent vehicle. So that's why I made it a 2K launch with e-brake and gas. Um, it would be faster to do a 4K launch. There you go, guys. Really nice. I'm still traps in the... Uh, 200s there. So all in all, it's a lot quicker than a lot of the vehicles that are around the same horsepower. Uh, let me show you guys my settings really quick. So make sure to be standard on steering wheel. If not, you will spin. If you are in simulation, please just be standard. Uh, manual with clutch on on always, and then uh, turn everything else pretty much off. So let's do another pass here real quick. Just e-brake gas. Let go of the e-brake. Really, really good. Let's see what it does here in the half a mile. And yeah, that was some of the video. Really nice car. It looks great. I honestly love the body kit on it. Um, real nice, subtle body kit with the turbo sitting on the top. Got the, the front mount and all that. You know, just looking good with the wide body. I honestly like the car. I, I kind of wanted it to have about the same horsepower as the other cars. You know, around like 13 to 1500 horsepower. They didn't have to go crazy with it, but it is what it is. Let's full gas and see what happens. Nice, 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 nice. There we go. We got a 14 there in the half a mile. So honestly, not that bad there in the half a mile. So pretty, pretty, pretty good. I think I I don't have anything saved on here for the quarter. Got some people over here. Yeah, those are fast. Those uh, vans there. Band's got a lot of power. Yeah, that sums up the video. Hopefully, you guys like it. Subscribe, enjoy. See you guys around with another drag to the video. Peace out, everybody. Bye bye.